Hi, my name is Aaron Alsop, and I'd like to share with you a DIY light that I made to solve a problem I had in a short film I produced last summer. And I call this light the Pizza Pie Light. Okay, camera rolling, plate. Scene 7M, take 5. Watch. Look what happens when you are filled with hope. Cannot touch it. So, last summer I was making the short film Yara's Boy. I'll have a link in the description if you want to check it out. We had a scene that when we were planning it out, we were a little confused on how we were going to go about lighting it. In this scene, Yaro is sitting with his son on his bed in the middle of the night and summons an orb of light. Now, when we were trying to figure out how to light this, we wanted a light that rests between the two of them and would shine and kind of glow up under their faces. It was really difficult to find a light that could do that. The director of photography, though, found a great tutorial by Shane Hurlbut about a light that he used in one of the films he uh, was the DP for. I took a look at that tutorial and was able to adapt it to our needs, and came, and it came to be known as the Pizza Pie Light. Now, the Pizza Pie Light is extremely easy. It's just three pieces. It is a pizza pan, but specifically this pizza pan that has the holes in it, so it. Uh, for the pizza, it's supposed to make it crispy, but for me, it was easy because I could put the LED rope light on here and then use just these plastic straps through these holes to tie it down. Now, when we were making it, uh, we didn't really have any rhyme or reason on, on how we did it. I tried to you know, do a strap every few off, so often around there, as you can kind of see, but it's really haphazardly. But the nice thing about it though is it does create this very nice soft look that you can just lay down and it's very thin. I'm going to turn these lights off so you can see kind of how it looks. Okay, so I've got the Pizza Pie light on the ground right now. Now just in case you are curious, my camera settings right now are at ISO 400, shutter speed of 50, and I'm at f2.8. So this is the Pizza Pie light on the ground. I'm going to pull it up so it's a bit closer to me. Uh, while we were filming, uh, so this is where it's at, I'm going to just drop it a little bit so it's just kind of resting on my lap. When we were filming, it was kind of about at this level. Now, as you can see, it does kind of obviously create the shadows because the light is coming up. However, because that was the only light source, this orb of light was the only light source, that's kind of the look we wanted. Now, the thing I love about this is because it's in this plastic tubing, it creates a very soft look. So, for example, if I put the light right here, it's this very soft look here, and obviously we've got the shadows right here. Um, so I really like using the Pizza Pie light for if we need to you know, create a, something underneath, which is very thin, or even if you want to just kind of hang it up here, and you, know, you can just kind of adjust it, and you can see how the lighting differs. Now, there are some downsides to the Pizza Pie light. Uh, the biggest one is that it is very difficult to hang. Uh, it is very thin to just lay down, but on the back, um, there isn't really anything that hooks it there. Uh, I did have one of the plastic straps that created a kind of a little loop, and I was able to hang that off of a light stand, but overall, it's not the easiest thing to hang. However, if you are just looking for something to kind of lay down like this, or if you've got an extra grip that can kind of hold it up and kind of shine it on somebody, you know, I think it is a great DIY light that you can make, and it's pretty reliable. Now, a lot of people have asked, what did this cost me? Uh, the light itself was about $20 to $30. I did buy it in the summertime. Now that it is the holiday times, it's probably going to be a bit cheaper. It was a 40-foot light. Uh, the plastic straps were about $5, and then the pizza pie was about $15. So in total, it was around $50. Depending on where you get it, it'll, it might be a little bit cheaper. Anyways, that's the pizza pie light that I made. I hope you guys enjoyed this. If you have any questions about the pizza pie light, feel free to leave a comment below. Also make sure to subscribe, I'm going to have more tutorials coming your way 
with other lighting tips, other filmmaking tips, and just answering whatever questions you have. Anyways, thanks for watching.